Well, in terms of golf betting, it was uh, the Open. Faldo and the Masters got me interest, but I didn't have a bet on that. And then three months later, it was the Open Championship at Lytham. And uh, that's when I started thinking, oh, maybe I should get involved in some bets because uh, I just started betting. Uh, my first bet was a winner. I had two pound on uh, Steve Collins to beat Nigel Benn uh, in round four of their boxing bout at 40 to one. So um, that was nice to get off the mark with a winner. And then uh, I started looking at other markets and thinking, oh, you can bet on golf, you can bet on this, you can bet on that. And uh, yeah, I watched uh, most of the Open Championship, the 1996 Open at Lytham, and uh, Tom Lehman won that one. Quite a boring American player, didn't really uh, do much for me, but there was a player called Tiger Woods a youngster called Tiger Woods playing in his final event as an amateur uh, and he finished 22nd and I, 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 the final three rounds Tiger was fantastic over the final three rounds and I thought this fella this fella looks the business and uh, yeah, I think this fella could make me a lot of money yeah I was in a very emotional state Euro 96 England lost to Germany on my birthday uh, on penalty so it took me a long time to get over that I needed something I needed someone to pin my hopes on and Tiger Woods became that man when I saw him in the open at Lytham I thought this, this is the man to pin my hopes on this could be the, the man that changes my life uh, so I started backing him regularly uh, the first time I backed him he was 40 to 1 for the Greater Milwaukee Open that was his debut as a professional uh, he finished, um, finished 60th in that so no joy there but he won four starts later and then I started backing him for Open Championships uh, yeah Tiger became the man for me uh, and in the Open Championship I mean he won the Open Championship in 2000 by eight shots he won the Open Championship in 2005 by five shots he dominated St Andrews whenever the Open went to St Andrews Tiger was the man to be on and then uh, in 2006 he won his third Open at Hoylake so um, yeah Woods is the greatest champion of his generation and uh, yeah he'd been a punter's pal for me and many others